everyone, Stacy Burke here, and I don't know if this can be a grocery haul, it's not really, this is a Walmart slash Amazon haul, just like a mini haul, um, it's a little, it's another gloomy weekend, or weekday, or day, here at the beach, it's just we've been having marine layers, a little bit of cold, I'm sorry for everyone having a heat wave, has not reached here yet, it's a little chilly. I'm wearing a t-shirt from a concert I went to, thank God I went to it because the lead singer died like last year, Terry Hall. But this is the specials, I just kind of cut it up like this, and this is the this is the dates that they have. I went to the one in Pomona, and just wearing like, um, I don't know, what do you call them, dolphin shorts, track shorts, or whatever. Um, so, and so it kind of goes with it, I just tuck it in, and it's kind of an outfit, and I'm wearing vans tennis shoes actually these are children vans they don't i don't have to tie them up they have velcro on them so it's great um yes yeah, so i ordered some things from walmart and some things from amazon this is kind of a mixture haul because i've got more things but i'm just going to show you what i got today i figured i'll just show you because if you order online through amazon and walmart what i do is i put things in the cart and then i price compare and a lot of times with walmart it's not available like I'm still waiting for toilet paper or something like that like it's like I don't know it, you gotta like pick and choose what you feel like um to froze again so hopefully it works but like I said I'm not really I don't I'm not working in strawberry farm so I'm able to go to the store whenever I want so but there's some things that's not at the store and Walmart I know they have blueberry cobbler creamer but they've been out of stock for a while so through Amazon, they finally had it because they were out for a long time. They have blueberry syrup. So this is how I'm going to make my coffee now in the morning. I'm just going to get like the creme brulee or just kind of like some kind of creamer or something like that to make it taste like a blueberry cobbler. And I got the blueberry flavoring finally. I think this was like 12 or $13 at Amazon. I don't know the whole prices exactly because I got things here and there. But I think this was like $12 on Amazon, so that's what I got there. And on Amazon that just came in, I got my nail glue. It's brush on nail glue, and yes, I, I don't go to the salon anymore. After COVID, you just learn to do your own thing, and I kind of like it. I glue my lashes on, that's from Amazon. I, I spray tan. Of course, I do go out to the beach. <clears throat> I've been going out to the beach and trying to lay out. Um, it's just kind of boring to me. I usually just try to walk around or something or bike ride some kind of activity or, or get on my floaty because the water's pretty warm. I actually let out my floaty and I, and I kind of, what I do is I don't just float. I kick my, I, like, I, I kind of kick my legs and I kind of work out, kind of exercise a little bit. You know, so that's kind of my exercise lately. But this is just brush on nail glue. And I love it. So when it pops off, I just pop them back on. And after a while, you know, you have to just get new new set. And you could get these really cheap on Amazon too. I, I paint mine, but you can get them already painted. Just pick and choose. You can't go wrong. They're just you could even get cheapy cheapies like I do. And it's it's amazing. I'm sorry, nail salon workers, but this is my thing now. And I love it. This is what I got at Amazon. It's a smaller one, but um, it's flea season. And so I've been putting stuff on my pets and I spray the house daily. But as you know, you can never really get rid of it, especially when you have carpet. Yes, I'm one of the few people in the world that still have carpet because my place hasn't been updated since the 80s. And I'm not even kidding. I haven't lived here since the 80s. Well, I haven't lived in this building since the 80s. But... It hasn't been updated since the 80s. Um, so it's just, um, yeah, if you have carpeting, especially live on the beach, sand comes in, it's really hard. But I do spray my, I spray my home daily. I usually, in the winter time and other times I use Lysol for the, for the smell. And so, but these smell okay too, but this is flea and tick for home. And I spray the bedding, I, I just spray everything, everything. And my house is very ventilated. And it's safe for it's safe for the animals and stuff like this. This one might not be that safe, but it's seriously, my house is so ventilated that this is fine. But my favorite one that I get, they have another one I get on Amazon, but this I get on 
Walmart. And Walmart, this is only seven dollars and some cents, like eight dollars. And the other one, the Vet Best, I think I showed you. I should have brought it out, the empty bottle. I get Vets Best, um, not this one. I just got this one because it was like on sale or something for like nine bucks. But Vet Best is like, and that's another natural one. And that's like sixteen dollars or something like that for this size. This is like eight dollars. It's like ten dollars off practically. And it's natural care, so it's safe. Uh, to do around animals and it's just like it's just all natural peppermint oil and stuff like that just stuff that fleas don't like and stuff so I spray my house daily like I soak it my house in this like the bedding everything and so far so good like granted you're gonna get a flea you're gonna get a flea once in a while you get a couple you might you know mosquitoes you still get that's a different story I have the centernental candles I can't say that but I don't know if it really works I even have the Irish spring honey and you know what I don't know everyone says Irish spring works yeah not so much I don't know unless I'm doing it wrong you tell me I got Irish spring right here and and I I, I, I rub it around the doors like you're supposed to rub it around the doors so so flies don't get in ah uh, they still get in they still get in so I don't know let me know if I'm doing it wrong. I know rats, they say rat, it doesn't like, but I, I, have, I don't have a rat problem. I have cats, there ain't no way. Big bugs, even when those big, um, what do you call them? Those, those they look like cockroaches, but they're, they're the flying cockroaches. Sometimes when my doors open, one time I got smacked in the head, a flying cockroach came and flapped me in the head, came in, and uh, my cat took care of it. <laughs> my cat took care of it. So, um, yeah, so, yeah, let me know, Irish Spring, if Irish Spring works for you, or am I doing it wrong? Because I, I do it around my door jams, and and it's right there. And I still see the gnats, I see the flies flying around, you know. So, I don't know. I, I, I'm kind of just giving up. The doors are going to be open. Flies are going to come in. That's just the way it is. I use this stuff like crazy, petroleum jelly. I have chronic itching skin. I don't know who has it. It's not like psoriasis because I had psoriasis one time. It's not like that. See how I do that? Like little things bug me. Like that's why I need to grow my hair one length. I'm not going to cut bangs anymore. My my hair kind of broke off. And when the wind, that's why I have my hair in a ponytail because the wind blows little tiny hairs in my face. It just bugs me. Like when I have allergies, I'm always doing this. Um... I just have chronically, it's been going on for at least 10 years, if not longer. Um, I just feel, maybe I'm just overly sensitive. I just, when I feel something on me, I just scratch it. And of course, the more you scratch it, the more you itch. You know what I mean? Like, it's, it's like, it's like, and then it's almost like a nervous thing where I literally hurt myself. Like, I'll scratch it until it bleeds. Sometimes I used to wash my face until it bleeds. Like, um, this little thing bugs me. I'm just in, in the middle of the night, and sometimes I'll just like scooch and move, and you know, and then if I can't get an itch, it goes, it just drives me crazy. I don't know if anyone has that. Just, and I don't have like necessary dry skin. I moisturize a lot. In fact, I moisturize more in the summertime than the wintertime, and wintertime is usually when your skin is dry. But the beauty of wintertime, when you moisturize, you put on clothes, you put, put on a barrier, and the moisture stays in your body pretty much all day until you wash it off, right? But in the summer, you're out there in the elements, the wind and everything, and it takes off the moisture, or and you have to rinse off a lot. Like, I rinse off a lot because I get sandy. If I go on the beach, I got to rinse off, or if I... If I go for a swim, I gotta rinse, like I'm constantly rinsing off, and my skin has no barrier, so the friction of sitting down or laying down or anything, it, it takes the moisture off, and so I'm constantly moisturizing throughout the day, also to get rid of the itchies. Uh, so I'm going through so much lotion um, in the summertime, which is, you know, you would think would be opposite, but no, because you're rubbing it off. You're 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 rinsing off all the time. Anyway, I don't know how I got on that enhancement. So I got to get more lotion, and I haven't got it. I usually get Nivea Q10 lotion. I like it because you don't have to use much, and it glides on like 
Vaseline. Anyway, this is why I was talking about Vaseline. I use this in so many places, like <laughs> so many places, <laughs> so many places. Um, but it's good for taking off makeup. It's good for um, just anything. I just, it's like universal. And so, and also it does like when I get those, I also have powder. I have Gold Bond anti-itch powder and I use that in many places too. Whenever, you know, I just do because it's like, I just can't, I get really itchy. I know there's people out there with that. And I even try to Google it and, and it's just like, it's just normal. It's just normal, I guess. It's just normal. I have itchy skin. Not dry. Not really dry. Just itchy. Just, I don't know what it is. But anyway, this helps a lot of things. And it cleans things where it's like, sometimes when you have itchy skin, the water will dry it out more if you, if you wash it or clean it. And so Vaseline helps cleanse the skin without the water drying it out even more you know what i mean like so it's good for lots of things for cleaning your skin for moisturizing your skin to put a barrier on your skin i use it for many things so yes i had to get more petroleum jelly and i got the one with the i don't know the, with the cocoa butter or whatever in there but as long as petroleum jelly i'm good so i got that and I usually get flushable wipes, but they were very expensive, and he had to buy a lot of them, and I don't need a lot. I just want a few, because um, I don't really use these as much anymore, because I have the petroleum jelly. Um, but, um, yes, I do like my baby wipes, especially sometimes it feels like when you don't have time to shower, it's good just to clean everything, and of course, you know, the bathroom, stuff like that. So I had to get more um, baby wipes, and I'm running out of regular normal black trash bags i have the white trash bags as you know for the trash cans but these are for when i do laundry laundry delivery or when i just yeah, basic i carry my laundry and basically that's what i do so and, and other things like if i have like some if i want a double uh bag uh so i had to get that i think this was six bucks at um walmart really cheap for uh, 20 bags and I think I got this at Wal. No, I got this at Amazon. And I was gonna get this at Walmart, but it was it was too much money to ship it. So and it was only a dollar something at Walmart, but the shipping was too high. There's just some things you gotta like put your card in because some things they don't ship. They they have a separate shipping, so you gotta check it out. So I just got it at Amazon for like I think it was like two or three bucks. This I got at Walmart. This is canned food, can nine lives cat food. Um, and yeah, I've been doing this lately, you know, as giving my cats that way they get some moisture and I mix it with a little bit of water. However, they're getting a little picky, like they they'll eat a little bit. They don't like the leftovers. And then I, and I try to get them to eat it. And eventually I have to pour it down the drain and open a new can. <sighs> Divas, I swear. And the main reason why I started getting Walmart is they're the only ones that have my cat food that I, the dry cat food that I get my animals. As you know, I get the nine lives, I get the urinary tract, because urinary tract formula is very expensive elsewhere. And remember when I used to get it at um, Amazon for only $6 for a 15 pound bag? Those were the days. I should have grabbed so many of them. But now they've just been out of stock, out of stock. So I go to Walmart, so it's like $15 now like nine dollars more but at least they have it so this is why i go to walmart mainly and i i think if you if you if you spend more than 35 dollars, you get free shipping and that's why i had to buy more stuff because i would just get this but then you pay like i think six dollars or something like that for shipping so but if you buy over a certain amount you get free shipping and it's the same day so yeah so i got that and felix is looking at that so yeah, so I give this to all my cats, even the girl cats. doesn't matter. They like it. It couldn't hurt them, it's just, but it's, it's good for male cats. So that is my little grocery haul. Kind of like a little bit. Kind of like a little haul. Uh, just so you know what I get. This is what I, you know, I do have to go again um, soon. I'm running out of champagne since I'm home more often. And vegan cheese and stuff like that. But like I said, it can wait. So that's going to be the next time. Then I'll do that, and yes, I do wear these sometimes so my hands don't dry out. Um, 
I like my Playtex gloves. Um, okay, that's it. All right, that's it. <laughs> All right, I'm going to let you go. I'm going to try to go for a walk. i just been kind of just in a, a stump. i just been kind of, you know, just kind of depressed and sad and just sleeping. I just got to snap out of it and go for a walk outside. Even though it is a little chilly, it's a little cold. But um, I'm just going to go for a walk. And uh, so I'll talk to you later, okay? <laughs> to all my stays cadets and all my bricquettes, I hope you have a great day. Until next time, peace.